Hi, Bayshore. It's Pastor Sarah, and I'm here to give the announcements for this week, beginning January 3rd, going till January 10th. Well, I don't know about you, but I'm ready for us to get back to our normal schedule. Um, it was really nice, though, having that week off last week, and I did use it as vacation. I hope that you also had a restful, um, peaceful, and safe Christmas holiday season. So technically, we're still in Christmas holiday mode at my house because it is today the 10th day of Christmas, but I digress. Now, the announcements, though. I do want to remind you that, like I said, we're going back to our normal schedule. So that means on Wednesday at 930, I will begin a new pastor's Bible study. Um, I hope you join me for this new study. We're going to be doing something a little different. I'm, I'm thinking about doing more of a theme um, versus walking through a book of the Bible. And so we might find ourselves doing um, a study on big words and then reading scripture related to those big words like grace and also resurrection and things like that. Um, I'm still piecing it together and I will be sending out, I'm sure, an email or at least on Facebook posting about it. But uh, we will begin this week. Wednesday at 9.30 Central Standard Time. We're also going to begin our prayer time again on Thursday mornings at 10 a.m. And we have a very small faithful core that meets weekly to pray um, for our world, for prayer requests we receive. These are not recorded. These are not shared with other people. We do try to keep them as confidential as possible. Um, but if you have a prayer request, please do email it to me. We will pray for you or for whoever um, you have asked us to lift up in prayer. And again, we do that on Thursdays at 10 a.m. And all are welcome to join us. Um, you actually do not pray. I'm saying this because I found out through someone that uh, she was reluctant to come to our prayer time because she was concerned she would have to do some sort of prayer. And um, we have decided that I'm doing all the prayer. Um, not that I think I'm the best prayer person ever, but just simply that way people know if they do come to attend prayer time, they don't need to come prepared to say a prayer. You don't need to have something in your back pocket to say. Um, you simply um, are there in support to pray with me and to um, just to share in this truly special time together. So prayer times, Thursdays at 10 a.m. on Zoom. And then Friday, we're resuming our coffee chats again on Zoom. And this has actually been a really nice thing. Since COVID began, we have gathered weekly just for this time of social, social, socialness. <laughs> Fellowship, it's just been wonderful. I don't want to say it's a gossip time because it's not, but we do share with one another what's going on in our lives. We do talk about current affairs. Uh, we talk about um, what's going on in the city of Milwaukee and in our state and in our country. Um, we try to keep it light. We try to um, not, uh, you know, choose one way over another. Um, but it is a social time. We talk about movies. We talk about books, things like that. So if you're able, join us for those coffee chats with Pastor Sarah. And then on Sunday, January 10th. Now, I hope I've kept your attention because this is important. Okay, pay attention. Sunday, January 10th is Baptism of Our Lord Sunday. And I want us to remember all of our baptisms. So you have some homework, Bayshore. First of all, find out what day you were baptized on. What is your baptismal birth date? Find that out. And then also, if you have a picture of your baptism, of when you were baptized, bring it to worship. Bring it to worship. One of the great things about being on Zoom is that we can all hold up our pictures um, of what we looked like when we were baptized. And if some of you are really tech savvy, you can change your Zoom profile pic to be your baptismal pic. So let's have a little fun with this, shall we? I'm going to email more about this in our beacon. But for those of you who are watching me right now, you have a heads up. You need to know your baptismal birth date. And if you can, find a picture of you at the time of your baptism. All right. And then just to let you know, we did change schedules here a little bit. So we are not having Troubling the Waters this week, Thursday night on the 7th. We will begin Troubling the Waters discussion Thursday night, 
January 14th. So not this week, but the following week. And I do hope you join us for that. Do write it on your calendar so you remember that it's happening that day. And this is such an important discussion for us as a church to be having, talking about race relations, our racial um, bias that we have, and also our privilege. It's good for us to talk about it personally, but also as institutions, especially as the church. So I hope that you write this down and you join us on January 14th. Well, Bayshore, that is our announcements in a nutshell. It was wonderful worshiping seeing you all this morning um, at 10 a.m., even though I had tech difficulties. I hope and pray for you all. I hope and pray we enjoy a wonderful um, new year and many blessings to you and peace. Take care now. Bye-bye.